On a seemingly ordinary day in La Tinta, Guatemala, a rooftop gathering turned into a scene of horror. 15-year-old Deborah Rebecca Shi Artola and her three friends were having a photo shoot and dancing on the terrace of a home. Video footage captured these moments, showing them enjoying their time, unaware of the looming danger. As Deborah moved closer to the edge of the terrace, she came into contact with a high-voltage power line. Horrified onlookers rushed toward the building as her body was rested on the cable, surrounded by smoke. The high-voltage cables sent electricity surging through her body, decapitating her. Her body then fell nearly 20 feet to the ground, and she was pronounced dead at the scene. The incident is under investigation, as authorities work to confirm that the tragedy was an accident. The investigation will likely focus on the safety measures in place at the location. The incident sparked a wave of grief and concern within the community, with many expressing condolences and support to the family. The incident also raised concerns about safety measures in public places, particularly in areas with high-voltage power lines. The lack of safety railing and clear warning signs at the site of the accident is an issue that extends beyond just that location and is a widespread problem in urban and residential planning. As the investigation continues, it's crucial that authorities and community leaders work together to ensure public places are safe and such accidents don't happen. And it's important for kids to know just how dangerous these power lines are.